Time to hear from Aaron Boone now in the manager's report brought to you by Geico. Aaron, you've played a lot of close games lately and a lot of close games with this White Sox team with a lot of back and forth. Can you finally exhale now after this series a little bit coming out uh, now winning 10 out of your last 11 series? Yeah, exhale here for a minute. Obviously, getting on a happy flight is always well, always a good thing. Going to, going home to start a really important homestand. Um, man, it's a good team over there. Our guys did a lot of really, really good things today. Got interesting there, obviously, in the ninth, but um, this is a really good series. After a tough loss in, in, in the Field of Dreams game, guys just continue to, continue to pound away. And, uh, you know... Uh, just a just an all around a really good win for us today and 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 a good series win for us. You mentioned a really good team over there. You look at that offense and the job that Nestor Cortez did navigating himself through it. Just how impressed were you with him this afternoon? He was great to give us six innings, six strong. Uh, I thought his stuff was really good today. I thought it was he was crisper than he was in Kansas City right from Jump Street. I just thought he had a his pitches were were crisp, you know, kind of confirmed with uh, with Higgy or in the early innings that he's got his stuff today, um, and that was apparent. And and you got to have it against those guys. Those guys, you know, especially you know going up against those tough righties, it's it's a tough not lineup to navigate. But he really he really did it. You know, really think about the first inning. He's probably going to get out of that in like six or seven pitches, a couple bloops that make it a longer inning. But otherwise, you know, he was he was in complete command. Vaughn put a good swing on him to break up the the shutout. But um, he was really strong for us and put us in position to win this series. What was it about his stuff that made him so effective? I think just uh, the command, the crispness. You could just tell from the side. His fastball had really good life to it. I thought, um, you know, his changeup was good. Um, you know, he was able to throw any pitch at any time um you know i thought he did a good job of when he did mix in some you know some of his alt alternate deliveries i thought it was, the timing of it was good and he executed when he did it um but just an all-around really strong effort with some guys not maybe being available other guys struggling have you found it to be a challenge trying to navigate the end of the games this series Look, it's it's opportunities, and we're finding out a lot about other people. Um, you know, guys that are getting an opportunity in some high leverage spots that have that have come through for us. And uh, you know, another great job by Wandy of, of you know he's he's pitched a lot here these last few days. He comes in and 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 gets some weak contact to get us out of that inning. Obviously, low going through their righties. I wasn't going to use him a lot today. He was really good ridings. You know, the, the leadoff walk, you know, I think, you know, kick himself for that. But otherwise, I thought he bounced back and threw the ball really well today. So, um, you know, guys are we're finding out some good things about some guys that that are that are creating a little bit of depth down there and we got to continue it.